My name is Kelly and I work with girls who are frustrated and um, anxious because they think that they're bad at math. So I make math make sense using play and art and visuals so that uh, girls feel confident and they get excited about math. I'd recently started my business officially, Artful Math, and I had done uh, an online course the year before that just didn't work. I actually lost money doing that course over, over a full year. And um, at, at the time that I found Miracy, I was just starting a second online course and it was an opportunity for me to see exactly how to do it. Even though it, it so it, it seemed expensive to me, but it came at the perfect time because I was just about to start a new course. And um, so it was like, well, here, this, this course can, can teach me how to do my course the right way. It was like a step-by-step -step thing. It had coaches. So I thought I really didn't have to think twice about getting it because it was, it was just came at the perfect time for me. The framework of Danny's framework was really helpful because it was really well done and really well laid out and I just followed it step by step. And then when I did hit roadblocks, I would talk to my coach and um, so that, that was, that, it, it's a really great system. It felt like, I don't even know how to say this. It, 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 it felt like I, I bought a program that was a, a very well done program and then there was this coach thrown in on top of it that made it a whole nother thing. Um, I don't know. Um, it, it, it was like, here's a coaching program, here's a how to run your, your, your course program. It was both of those, right? Course Builders Laboratory, I think the biggest way they changed how I was gonna launch a course was uh, this idea of doing a pilot first. I think I'd heard of that before, but um, it was a very, very big part of this program that you do a pilot, you do a little piece of it first, test it out. If it works, then you do the next step. That was a huge game changer for me. My goal with the pilot was to get 10 people and I did get 10 people. I made, I don't know, $1,000 or about $1,000, um, $97 per course. And so the pilot was an, a resounding success. Launching the pilot was really fun. I, I had so much fun with the pilot because it I did a lot of stuff live with these parents and I felt very connected to the parents. Um, I felt I really liked them and they liked me. A lot of them actually came back later and bought other courses and programs from me. Um, I, I, I loved, I just loved teaching them. I loved, I loved talking to them one week and then the following week putting together the answer to their questions in a course. That was really fun. What was harder for me was doing the official course because I felt like everything had to be perfect. And so I was doing like a full on launch with webinar and, and like fancy sales page and everything I felt had to be just right the second time around. Whereas in the pilot, I was just having fun with it. So it was a, for me, it was two different experiences, but, um, but I learned a lot from doing that official course that yeah, doing the doing it so perfectly and if officially, that's not that doesn't necessarily make a better course. So I created a full course when I was done. It was awesome content, and it had a lot of things that would help parents um, that I thought that I thought would help parents. But what I learned from that is that um, I even after answer, asking all of those questions of the parents, I still had this like narrow view of what I wanted to do. And there were still things that I wasn't listening to. So when I stepped back from that after creating the course, I realized they wanted something very different. One thing that I would do differently in the future is instead, what, instead of doing a small pilot and then from there a full-on course, I would do a small pilot and then a slightly bigger pilot and then a slightly bigger pilot, especially if the course, the, the full course is different, at all different than the initial pilot. There was too big of a gap between what I did as a pilot and what I did as a course. So in the future, I would keep asking questions, keep putting out a new pilot, keep getting feedback, 
just get a lot more communication along the way. Um, that was a really valuable lesson that I learned from all of that. Yeah, so I think it, the, the Miracy team, I think of the Miracy team in two parts. There was the coach and then there was the community. So I loved my coach and talked to him all the time. Um, they, but they also had this Facebook group where all the members of the community would go on and you would say what you were working on, if you had questions or whatever. And um, it was just, just a very involved community and I felt very connected to them. So I had, I had help from both ends, from the coaching and also from the other folks who were in the trenches with me. If you are considering doing a course or you're about to start a course, this is a great program to do simply because it, it gives you everything. It gives you the framework, so really a step-by-step, -step, this is what you do first, second, third. Um, it gives you the coach and individualized feedback, so you're not just trying to figure out how to apply it to your own business the best way you can. And there's also a community, so when you get stuck and you're frustrated because stuff didn't happen, you have all of these amazing people who are backing you up and giving you suggestions, even really practical suggestions about how to do a webinar. Yeah, it's, it's really, an, Danny has done an amazing job with this program.